In this lesson, you can learn how to design this beautiful round table meeting infographic slide in PowerPoint. I am using some keys during the design. These keys will make your job more easier and convenient. Go to format background. I am going to give it some different color. This one, go to insert and take this uh, hollow shape and uh, drag it by holding shift alt okay let me fix it align center and align middle let me fix it and to through this anchor point i am going to fix it and you can uh, make it uh, size according uh, to your requirements take uh, a rectangle and drag a rectangle vertically like this align center and align middle Control d to duplicate it and uh, again align center and align middle by holding alt key and uh, press the right arrow key three times every time by holding uh, alt key and press the right key three times i'm going to select some areas this one this one and the fourth one this this one the fifth sixth seven and eight by holding shift and delete i'm going to also delete this part go to insert and take a, a triangle triangle where is triangle this this one yes take a triangle by holding shift alt and drag it and uh, rotate and place it here on this part over this part and align perfectly make it at the center of the shape and uh, select both merge union select all and the shape outline make it no outline control G to group it okay I am going to give it a 3d rotation let me give it a manual 3d rotation 3 1 5 and uh, the y rotation will be 3 2 5 and the z rotation will be 60. hit enter okay let me make it a little bit bigger in size and uh, you can uh, resize it according to your requirements let me make it uh, okay that uh, it uh, gives a perfect look control d to duplicate it and uh, place this part uh, here for a uh, later use select this one and uh, i am going uh, to give it some colors one by one this color palette i prepared and uh, this color palette is uh, from light to dark goes from from light to dark okay let me select one by one and through the eye draper i am going to give this color one by one this one the fifth one sixth one and seven okay let me through the eye dropper the last one color give the last one color okay i am going to make its depth go to 3d format and uh, make uh, its depth around about 17 18 and you can increase or decrease according uh, to your desired oh sorry control z again okay align so select uh, this one align center and align middle now select this shape uh, that uh, I place it at the side align center and align middle 
and give it a, a gray color some gray color let me check it okay let me this one yes i think this will be okay and uh, send to back and uh, move it down a little bit that uh, it gives the shadow effect to the upper shape so control g to group it now i'm going to insert some icon go to the icon tab and uh, here you can find your uh, required icon just tap your text in the search icon bar and uh, you will find your desired icon here okay select uh, this one this one i need seven icons so this one and insert insert and bring it to the slide let me place it uh, here uh, and i am going to uh, convert it to shape from svg one by one go to group ungroup and uh, again control g to group it now this uh, at uh, this way we can convert an svg file to shape pill i'm going to convert these uh, icons one by one that's why uh, why i am going to convert svg to shape fill because i am going to place it in a perspective and uh, okay this one control g to group it and place it here at the side and uh, group go to ungroup and uh, yes again control g to group it the last one group ungroup yes and uh, control g to group it now select all and i am going to give it a white color now go to shape fill and uh, give it white color this one and uh, i am going to place it in a perspective go to rotation and uh, choose this one now i am going to put uh, these icon one by one over these shapes and uh, i have seven icons and uh, seven shapes you can increase or decrease these shapes according to your requirement okay this one goes this icon goes here and i am going to replace the briefcase at uh, this point and uh, this uh, icon goes here control z to back and uh, this one icon goes here this icon goes i think uh, here yes search uh, of customer and uh, here is a meeting of uh, two boss and uh, here uh, in an idea okay it's okay let me bring some text to the slide that i have typed earlier to save the time Control c and Control v to bring it to the slide sorry select this one and uh, this one for uh, heading for headline Control v and place it here and i am going to place the text one by one Control D to duplicate it and place it here. Friends, if you have not subscribed my channel, please subscribe it and hit the bell icon to get every time a new design. Okay, let me place this text here and this one will go here and uh, this one is 
will go here okay let me put the headline I'm going to align it that it gives a premium look and uh, I'll go to text option and I'm going to give it some shadow effect to the text this one and uh, I'm going to make the text round table sorry round table meeting okay it's perfect and let me place it here at the center of the slide i'm going to bring some meeting people that they are going to meeting okay here at the center and uh, you can uh, change these in the color of the table the color of the employees this is a hundred percent SVG file and I will drop a link to the of this round table like this you can change its color let me make it a little bit light and thank you for watching.